video number 9 of the Casio G-Shock G5600E1. This is a sportier watch than the other ones I've shown you. Uh, this looks like the classic G-Shock, but it has the addition of being solar. Here's the side view and the back view with the logo and some of the specs. You'll see the back has uh, the metal and some screws is unlike other ones, other watches I've reviewed. Now going back to the face, you have your mode and adjust button on the left side. On the right side you have the light and search. Now if I press mode, you can change to another time zone. You have your alarms here, stopwatch, timer and back to the daily time day and date turn off the light so you can see the back lit incredibly bright and there's actually an option where you can automate have it automatically turn on by the turn of your wrist and you can see different symbols here and here, PS stands for power save, and the power indicators down here with low, medium, high. And then on the other side, the snooze alarm and the hourly signal. I'll show you how to how it sounds with the alarm and how to set this. And if you all like uh, this video. Um, Please leave a comment and let me know if you want me to show you all the different functions. Um, that would be a more in-depth uh, video, which actually might be kind of interesting. Um, but with this watch, it's it's incredible how many things it does for the price. So I'll activate this alarm. Very easy to set pretty intuitive. This watch has four alarms and one snooze and what I mean by a snooze alarm is that you can press it, uh, deactivate it with any button that you press and then five minutes later it will go off again and it'll do that a few times. <clears throat> find myself using the timer almost on a daily basis uh, for when I run or if I'm doing some sort of cooking. This is a very practical watch which is uh, why I've now adopted it as my daily watch. Um, aesthetically it's not as uh, pleasing as some of the other ones but its functionality is amazing. So there you have it, that's the alarm. It's not as loud as a cell phone alarm or a traditional alarm clock, but it's still very decent beeping. Overall, I would recommend this watch for the utility. Here's a wrist view. Thank you for watching. Please comment and subscribe.